My name is Jeff White, and I'm the research entomologist for Bedbug Central and the host of Bedbug TV, bedbugcentral.com. I have no idea how I got into bugs and bedbugs. And here I am six years later and having a lot of fun working with bedbugs. And I'll be talking to you about pest control. Uh-oh, you might have found a bed bug in your house. And so the first question you're going to ask yourself is, what do I use to kill these bugs? A lot of people see news stories about bed bugs becoming resistant to pesticides. And if they're resistant to pesticides, how are you going to get these bugs out of your house? What are you going to use to kill them? Well, the trick is not killing the bugs that you can see. It's knowing that most of the bed bugs that may unfortunately be in your home are hiding in cracks and crevices. And so it's all about how do you kill the bugs you can't get directly to. And so when it comes to killing bed bugs, you could use a hammer, a shoe. Bed bugs do squish. They're not like ticks. People think of, you know, ticks and, and how hard they are to squish in your fingers. Bed bugs are not that hardy and you can readily squish them. So there's lots of things you can use to kill the bugs that you can see. If you're going to buy a pesticide, you can buy over-the-counter pesticides. A lot of the pesticides will kill bugs on contact. If you spray them directly, most cans of pesticide will kill them. But remember, the question is the bugs that are hiding, the bugs you can't get to. Because once those pesticides dry, they may have no or very little effect on bed bugs. And the one thing I can say about pesticides is follow those label directions. Read the label very carefully. We've unfortunately heard of people hurting themselves with pesticides because they don't follow the directions properly. They're there for your protection. And so it's not about, you know, how to kill bed bugs. 91% isopropyl alcohol can be one of the best ways to kill bugs and eggs on contact. You can go to your local store. You want to be careful with alcohol, though, because remember, it is flammable, and you can actually harm yourself with the vapors that alcohol releases. And so you want to use it in a targeted fashion. And so it's not about how to kill bed bugs, whether it's a shoe, a hammer, a can of pesticide, or some isopropyl alcohol. There's lots of ways to kill them. It's about how to get to those bugs that you can't see.